And a hello, 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 Vikings! Welcome back to another awesome good Valhalla live stream. So in this one, we are gonna see what Reda, the useless, what he's gonna have for us today. So let's fast travel to the Raven's Torp and let's see. So, like always, I'm gonna do the settings, and after that, we are ready to start. Just need to do a few things, and my doggo might go actually crazy at some point, so don't mind that. Alright, alright. So far, my PC is working a little bit slower, but let's see. And I would actually like to know at the start what you are hoping from Reda in this reset or in the dailies or in the next week or in the future in general. So let me know what you are thinking, what you want to see from Reda. Personally, Hell's Damnation Helmet to complete. Well, I'm not sure if I'm gonna complete the Hell's Damnation pack that way, but that is the coolest piece from that pack, in my opinion. And hello, Inner Riser. Hello, Lena. How are you guys doing today? Uh, how are you? I can't wait to see how Redley disappoints us this week as well. Yeah, definitely, definitely. And if you are actually refreshing the page, you should see a new thumbnail that I just added. So let me know what you think of today's thumbnail. And let me know afterwards if it, it if it was was uh, if it was accurate. Sorry, I have just woken up like less than one hour ago. So, hey Danny, how are you? Welcome to live stream, mate. Zylak, hello, Danny. So, how are you guys doing today? And what you are hoping from Reda? Let me know. Reda, the useless. Hello there. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Our favorite little clown, aka Reda. So I don't think I have I've any got more a contract for me. contracts. Day, I believe I did everything yesterday, but let's let's recheck. Interested? I mean, losing five opals every three days or so. Yeah, cannot lose on that of five just by mistake. What do you have today? So let's go into the yesterday's and last week's selection. So pretty awful. Yeah, pretty much nothing was worth your opals last week. But it is what it is, I think uh, I think. So let's see, let's see. And I think I'm almost, well, pretty much done with the settings and how much time we have left. Ooh, 10 minutes and 45 seconds-ish. So, let's see, let's see what Red Earth Useless will have in a few moments. So I'm gonna share this stream and then we are ready to go, ready and rock and roll. Uh, let's see, at this point I can't hope for anything, this game is becoming more and more extinct day by day. Yeah, pretty much, pretty much. And Reda is definitely not helping by any means. So let's see how much we will disappoint this week. So let's see, let's see. Oh gosh, my ping cord in my Discord. It is a little bit slow today. And yeah, if you want, you can also join my Discord. Link should be in the description box. If not, let me know. So that have been done, that one only feeder remains. 
Uh, anything else than tattoos would be nice. I never buy tattoos. I mean, I buy the tattoos, but usually they are really cool face tattoos. But still, totally understandable. Six now, so I will miss today's daily contracts. Oh, hopefully you can get well soon in a riser. Yeah, on the weekly. If you are sick and you cannot play today, definitely something good on the weeklies would be preferred. But yeah. Have a good day. If it's up to Reda, we are not gonna have a good day. That is definitely for sure. Uh, can you read later of Reda? I listen it again now. Or I found it more interesting. Oh yeah, that thing. Just let me see. I've go with your go. So, this later, yeah, definitely makes more sense if you have played the Origins. A warning, my beloved. I have heard numerous tales now of a secret codex circulating among the acolytes of our bureaus, both within and without the Empire of Augustus, called the Magus Codex. It names you directly as one of the founders of the Hidden Ones, apart from putting your life in danger. It flies in the face of what we have tried to achieve with our brotherhood. We are justice seekers who shun the light of praise for our good works and who must live in the shadows of our triumphs. Should you see any pages of this codex, I advise you to destroy them. Keep the dream of our hidden ones alive. Oh, I am not so naive to think this will be a simple task. Few men and women are suited to keeping such secrets for so long. And it may be that we will fail in the end, but we will have failed in the name of righteousness. Take care, my love. My Iset. My northern star. Even in my waning years, I am ever your Osiris. Let our Horus live on beyond us. I think of you often, Hajul. At sunrise and twilight, at new moon and full, when the rain falls and the breath of a moon rides across my neck, I remember you kissing me. Just there, and I will take that feeling to my tomb. And hey, Make and Silak, why do you think they added the letter? Well, I'm not sure, but I believe. It has something to do with Reda, as we can see. The, that thing, the letter, it is at the Reda shop. And yeah, Reda was in Origins. So I believe that's why the Hidden Swans letter is here. Kinda highlighted, so yeah, I believe it because of the Always Origins. Nice to see a friendly face. And we so did see Reda over there. I really think that is the what reason. Today? Uh, this blue you're wearing is part of the... It is actually have part of up? no set, basically. I'm and we have five minutes time, so I have plenty, to, plenty of time to show you how you can actually do this. So you need the Trolls do Tunic and Trolls Preachers. And they need to be transmogged. Oh, why? Why these are showing as new? I have no idea. But yeah, you need these ones. And when you do this, as you can see, the clothing is changing from brownish, blackish. to blue and what you need to do we need to go to gunner or any blacksmith in that matter and you need to transmog something what have you got for me today so to the change appearance so you need the trolls tunic and 
you want to apply this to merchant one on the trials tunic. Done for now. If that doesn't work, try same with the boots. And when putting both of those items on, you should get this bluish color. And the cloak I'm having, it is the Reaper cloak from the Seeds of the Paris. I have hidden the Reaper bracers, even though they are pretty cool with this set. And this is something just for fun. And you can actually buy this for a few more minutes if you want. But yeah, let's see, let's see how what much we are gonna be disappointed what in a couple today? minutes. Yeah, and for those who are after the authentic look, this might be actually perfect. Because that is, that is just blue. And hopefully my doggo won't go crazy or my kids won't fight this time. So let's see, let's see. Never know what's gonna happen in the in the live streams. So three more minutes. You have the modern day helmet for 120 opals on daily. Garbage, 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 and more garbage on the five slots of the daily items for 35 opals each. And the shinobi only hood, the hoodless hood, for 120 opals. 2 minutes 30 seconds until the reset. So let's see, let's see what we are gonna get from this clown over here who was pointing at us. And Reda didn't anybody tell pointing is rude. Hi, pipe, pipe. So, and of course, if you want to become a channel member and use custom emojis and get other perks. Depending on the level, you can use like the high pipe up emoji. And if we are gonna get into the spending spree, there is also opal emoji for that one. But that is kinda sus, in my opinion. So, yeah. But yeah, one minute, 40 seconds. I must see you later. Let's see, let's see. And by the way, if any. One of you have figured out a meaning, purpose for this stick from Don Fragnarok, let me know in the comments in the chat. Depending if you're watching this later or in the live stream, so. Because I still refuse to believe that is just this. Why they would add like comments when Harvey okay, is picking day. into up. What do you have today? So one minute, one minute. Final countdown. Let's go, let's go. And I think I will let my dog out, maybe. Not yet, not yet, so The wooden stick is simply the best weapon in the game. Yeah, definitely Killian. One of the best weapons, even though you cannot upgrade it and it's a really low level. Reda, what is it you do here? That what is a good question. You're looking at a man of boundless skill and talent. I sell the finest and rarest items in the world. <laughs> that is I so big of life. Rarest items. Only, only tattoos, only tattoos. Occasional what do you have today? decoration piece for the settlement. Or and we are missing one weekly once again. What a surprise. On the daily we are having military monuments from the modern day pack, 35 opals. Saxon Cross, Sediment Decoration, 35 Opals uh, Mystical Pants, 400 Opals The 2 set perk emit a Poison Cloud after 10 consecutive hits on the Poisoned Enemy So that is pretty ridiculous, but if you are using daggers and doing boss fights that might be actually useful The 
pack that should not be named left arm tattoo 35 opals of course there has to be at least two tattoos and mystical pack tattoo 35 opals and ghost wolf mount that is actually pretty exciting from scale 1 to 10 all of these items and including the missing one i don't know what's gonna be in here i think we are gonna know if somebody is gonna see that in day or so but from scale 1 to 10 i think yeah we have seen this one before this one was new i think maybe i don't know i buy it so from scale 1 to 10 i would say this is like 2.3 out of 10 so nothing that exciting but the wolf mount it is pretty okay and if you want to be fast and get the items buy it wait it until you are seeing the pop-up or if the pop-up doesn't show you need to see the check mark on the item you want thank you i am sure i will see but yeah the wolf mouth that was pretty pretty awesome let's see let's see i have request thieves couple of richest merchant i'm not surprised at all that we are getting the thieves couple that is almost every day on our daily little to no variation on the daily quests so sorry kitsune you are gonna be changed to the stables let's see let's see i would like to see what and the wolf mount So actually I think the wolf mount aid is pretty cool looking, transparent and I think this is gonna be much better in the night time so let's change. Uh, finally at la last week at the mount going to get it throughout this week. Oh nice! Hey Geo! Hey George! Wow, more nothing. <laughs> yeah, Reda is the clown. So, kind of cool. Not for all, that is for sure. And yeah, like I said, Dogo will go crazy. And I will throw him out if he continues that. So, let's do the dailies, the weeklies, and seems like we are missing one daily once again. We are having one daily here, one weekly here. Then going in Dawn of Ragnarok, we will see on another daily the Karas or Redas challenge. So, let's see, let's see. And yeah, the dog is gonna be out of here. So, let me know what you are buying, if you are buying anything, or are you gonna save your opals? Uh, and I mean if you have like, plus 1k, 2k of opals, yeah, why not, why not buy something? A wow military monument. Yeah, for that one I'm not so excited about. Come on, here we go. So wolf, ghost wolf. So this is 150 opals for one week. Not that bad in my opinion. At least it is a mount, it is a wolf, not a horse. Mm, again, yeah, again one missing daily, uh, weekly I mean. And I don't remember last time it getting fixed one before that one when we did have the miss missing weekly. It was fixed by Friday. I think it was Friday. But yeah. So Taurus Lumber. Come on. 
Come on. What? Here we go. So, no need to confirm the kill if you can assign it target. So, 300 XP and 5 opals. Boom. Let's move on to the weekly quest. I will. And as you can see, I did, did buy it already. But yeah, missing contract, missing day, uh, missing weekly. What I can say, what I can say, disappointed like always. Um, pretty cool, will grab it if I can earn two opals. Have you cleared the maps out of the opals yet? There are like two, three hundred opals per map. In England, of course, there will be more. So, hey Varun, uh, widget you are wearing looks like simple and cool at the same time. I will show after the loading screen and yeah, sorry about the loading screens. I'm playing on the PS4, not even Pro, but PS4 Slim, I think it was Slim. So the loading screens, they are all full. So just a second and I will show what I'm wearing in the game. Uh, two more exams and then the grind is on. Oh nice! And good luck on the grind. <laughs> Let's get down, so we can sew the gear a little bit better. Ooh, here, a little bit, little bit more light. So, the boots, they are pretty basic. The tunic, pretty basic. The preachers. Oh, sorry, gauntlets, they are also pretty basic, nothing that flashy. And the cloak, I think this is pretty realistic look overall. And the weapon, it is the most realistic weapon in the game. So, on the weapon, I'm having my off hand off. On the main hand, I'm having the wooden stick, the best weapon in the game, believe it or not. With this weapon in the Karas domain in the arena, I was able to do over 400,000 damage on the boss. On the bow, we are having the cotton bow at the moment from the last from the last week. Yeah, I think it was last week. Here we are having trolls tunic and the trolls preachers, and these are the key parts for the blue looks. So you need to transmoke on the troll's tunic, the merchant one. And same for this one, if it's not working and you have... Well, both of them must be visible. So if I'm gonna hide, let's say the preachers, boom, hide it and boom. Even though this is not that bad look at all. I think this is actually pretty cool, but we are... <laughs> yeah, bare feet it. And that is not cool look. Coming back into the inventory and putting the preachers on visible mode. Boom, blue. So once again, hide, unhide. So this is pretty neat, cool little trick. And yeah, on the the cloak and the preachers. They are from the Reaper set, from the Seeds of the Paris, and yeah, I have hidden my helmet, the modern day one, even though I think this is pretty cool look as well. But this is not realistic at all. But yeah, let's do the weekly for 300 XP and 20 opals. So about 500 meters cinematic mode. Oh, I just want to see that wolf a little bit better. Uh, hey, Fianor, good morning and welcome to live, live stream. I liked deploy it. Oh, thank you, thank you. Yeah, Reda is a joke stream. I totally agree with that one. <laughs> I sat on my 
Fianor, I want to know how that is possible, how you are accidentally sitting on your keyboard. Freda is a joke lately, uh, I appreciate the ghost, but just bad selection. And yeah, let's not forget the missing weekly and missing daily quest as well. Oh, I never used the wooden stick. Thank you, Gio. And Lena, I think you definitely should give the wooden stick a go. So if you want to see, I have a couple short videos where I'm doing 200k and 400,000 damage on the enemies in the Karas domain with the wooden stick. So if you want to see that, check those shorts, a little bit shorter videos after the live stream. Have a look. All right, there. But yeah, the wolf, ghost wolf looks pretty, pretty okay in my opinion. And of course, Thorn of Slumber, I actually don't like to confirm the kills. Come on, oh yeah, the Blast Wave. So, as a net target, well, that one failed. Boom! There we go. Easy. 20 opals, 300 XP. Boom. Quest completed. So, sorry about this, but we are gonna fast travel to Ravenstorp, the longest loading screen in the game. And yeah, let's take another look of Reda selection, if you did miss that one, then we are heading to the Svartalheim of doing the Karas Domain. I'm out in the market and the keyboard sits next to me, oh yeah, that is actually pretty believable. I mean I have sat on my controller a couple of times. I'm sitting on the couch and sometimes I left my controller next to me. If I need to reach my water bottle or my coffee cup, yeah, accidents happen. Yo, thank you as a member. So I want to try, so do I say it like Casper or Casper? But welcome as a member and let's get hype and let's get Casper hype in the chat thank you mate thank you and while we are doing this and while we are waiting on the loading screen i need to go into the settings once again and your name will be added into the member list Here we go. Your name has been added in the description box down below. And of course you are gonna get a visual shout out among with other members of the channel in end of most of my videos. Greetings. Alright, so let's today? see the shop once again. Oh plus my ass is a bit too big. <laughs> oh but yeah. Missing daily quest from Reda on the daily mini military monument for 35 opals on the weekly Saxon Cross 35 opals mystical pants from the mystical pack 100 opals The pack that should not be named left arm that two woohoo that twos 35 opals Okay, this is the best item in the game, but we are not gonna have it because Yeah, Ubisoft doesn't want us to have a nice things in the game and of course the ghost, the wolf mount, 150 opals that I'm currently using 
and last and least this time mystical pack that two thirty five opals. Have a good day. I must you go on. And I wonder you. why my screen is shaking. When I'm talking to Reda, I think Avor is building up the anger. Come on, ghost. Come on. Let's see. Are we gonna see Chewie? Before we are heading into Svalheim. But yeah, we are kings of the castle, well, this time queens, but anyhow, anyhow. In the Svartoheim we go, let's see, let's see, and yeah. This Thursday I'm gonna be on time with the live stream because I'm off work. And the weekly channels are reset at Thursday, three hours after Reda. Yeah, three hours after Reda. 20 opals from the individual challenges and 10 opals if the community challenge is completed. And I will show you how in the live stream and where I think are the best places of completing challenges. And about the challenges, I'm actually working on a video thanks to Woodland Outcast. Yeah, Woodland Outcast, who did comment in one of my videos a very good cool place as well for the Avenge quest so avenging other players death so working on that video trying to get it out tomorrow and origins or or Valhalla if you have to choose one what is the best game I would say Odysseus is the best game by the amount of content well I think Origins Valhalla they are pretty much the same of course Valhalla would be the best if this game would work and if the Reda wouldn't chuck so broken game for 1.5 years Reda awful every week well every day every week yeah two things fix the game and make Reda better, then Valhalla will definitely be the top one. <coughs> uh, Origins, hands down. But I just felt the Odysseus, that was the smoothest one, and yeah, still I don't have the, well, either of the DLCs for the Odysseus, but I see what I can do at the summer if I'm gonna, if I'm gonna play the DLC for the Odysseus for, for the very first time. So let's see, let's see what is gonna happen in this summer. And of course I will keep you covered with the Valhalla content and the new upcoming game mode the for Goddard Saga. I think that is pretty much similar but bigger than the Mastery Challenges. So if you die, you have to start all over again. What? You don't belong here. Who did say that? Who dared to say that? Yeah, get out, get out of there. Get out of my way, Reda, Reda. On the stall, who's the silliest of them all? This guy, the clown that we all hate. I mean, he he was pretty good in Origins, in Valhalla. <laughs> He's definitely awful. And one thing I really Hello miss there. from the Origins and Odysseus are the farms, like money farms, XP farms, and also the Hega chests. So, again, quickly, garbage, garbage, garbage. Probably the best item, more carbits, mystical pants and the ghost wolf mount. Not only and yeah, like I said, we are missing one daily Look today. There will be 
If you are not you must be lucky. So into the Kadas domain. Let's see. Uh, Scott deals is for others are totally worth it. So if you can, I think you will have the blast playing them. Yeah, I mean I did have the blast playing the main game, although when the crossover was happening and I opened the game once again. I noticed I lost like 50 to 100 hours of gameplay. I mean, I did complete everything. Well, probably a couple side quests. But after I did log in, yeah, there were what, three, four cultists left. And yeah, also some main quests, side quests that I totally did do. But yeah, it is what it is. It's Ubisoft. I hope the four quarter saga is good as it's look and hoping it will come soon. Well I think we are getting the next update. Oh gotta check the calendar. So it is 21st of June right now. So we might get the update next Tuesday or 5th of July. I think next week, probably. Let's see. And like 2nd of August is the most likely. Likely for the next, aka the Saga update, because we are getting the Tombs of the Fallen Pack 2 before the new game mode. Let me tell you a story. Let's see what. Uh, oh my god. Weekly. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, Lil. The weekly stays up again and we are missing the weekly item and we are missing the daily quest so definitely not the best day in Valhalla. I will bear witness to your deeds in battle. Yeah, definitely Danny. Just left few questions the in the story. Of how I defeated two of the Muspel's greatest fighters. Yeah, same did happen to me in Dawn of Ragnarok. It was kind of hasted ending, but yeah. Oh, we are not getting everlasting powers. So, power of the wooden stick, Aza, she's down. Wipe the blood from my weapon. <laughs> yeah, dog order definitely on radar. Boom. That guy is gonna die from the lightning damage. Boom, there we go. Next. Fate steered me into the path of a mighty muspel, and that your end. I have you now. Boom, 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 boom. That was brutal. So, on night of 300 XP and 20 opals, uh, 5 opals I mean, I wish we could get 20 opals from the dailies. But yeah, 5 opals, 300 XP, almost leveled up. But yeah, I will still like to know, we did get some lagging. The purpose for the wooden stick, so do we have to bring this into the main game, into the castles, or somewhere in here, 
we are picking up the weapon so store Mjölna from this bridge about here nothing needed for that one except the Dawn of Ragnarok DLC and one location have actually been on my mind for a very long time but let's see where it was where it was I think it was right around here so let's fast travel because that place was pretty interesting and I don't recall anything for that place hey Chris uh, what do we have uh, what do we have uh, we are having two tattoos couple decorations missing weekly item uh, ghost wolf mount for 150 opals and mystical pants for the mystical pack for 120 opals and the wolf 150 not 100 uh, yo what is that armor again oh, i will show the armor again after the loading screen so hey tina how are you welcome to the live stream how are you doing today i hope to get new river raids in the river raid yeah that would be awesome with new rewards i definitely would play again but there is no reason after you have completed and got every reward from the river raids there is no point of going back at all but yeah you are getting the blue look with couple things but on the hood I'm having the Reaper one, Reaper cloak, also the Brazers are the Reaper one, the helmet, it is hidden, wooden stick and cotton bow also hidden, but we are having the Trolls tunic and the Preachers and what you need to do in order to get this blue look and not this look like black brown look both must be visible the tunic and the preachers and on the tunic you actually need to transmog the merchant outfit on the trolls tunic and boom there you go and huge shout out to smart Glitch gaming who actually did share this made it like one year ago or so and I really love this look uh, I'm doing well nice glad to hear glad to hear I think it was this location that is really interesting in my opinion but yeah I haven't figured out and I don't think anybody else have figured out the meaning or purpose for the wooden stick because I think there gotta be more when Javi is picking up the wooden stick hmm seems to belong into the castle that is basically the line that Javi is using after picking up the wooden stick so in my opinion there must be more and that must be more I think it is but like our beggars that we cannot farm the runes aka silver but yeah this platform and these things are pretty in interesting in my opinion the saga of the guardian so post stream post a video if you want to read everything and also we are having later on the ground Conundrum of, hi of the Historian It seems to have been abandoned long ago so I believe I have been in every basic location in Svartheim Except this one so there might be a trick or something for this place Because day and night he pawned it and yeah 
I have explored our lands far and wide, documenting many ancient structures, yet this place baffles me above all others, and its exact purpose remain elusive. So only that part and the wooden stick in Swardoheim and the look of this place, it is also interesting in my opinion, like tower of some kind or hidden entrance like we did have in Jotunheim. So what do you think? Is this place interesting or <laughs> did I get your attention with this place? But yeah, I don't know what to do in here. Basic tricks doesn't seem to do anything. Just like this, this thingy and the letter on the ground. So let me know what you think of this place. Uh, castle in Vinland maybe. Were there any ca castles in Vinland? And yeah, let's check the Reda once more before ending the stream, so. Let's see, let's see. Can we get two more comments so we get, can get 69? Hehe, <laughs> always funny, 69. Dirty. Yeah, I mean, 40 euros. It was a lot. A lot of money, indeed, for 20 hours, so pretty much the same length as the Brothers Druids or Seeds of the Paris and boom there we go 69 contributing to that yeah always funny thank you guys and now 70 but still we had the moment a few seconds with the 69 so thank you thank you and nothing sus about the 69 it is just a number And by the way, about the 69, why does plant can count to the 70? Because the plant will have his or her mouth full of something after 69. But I'm okay, that was a really bad joke. But yeah, Reda, Reda on the stall. Who's the poopiest of them all? Looking good, Looking good. yeah, thank you. And yeah, I hate why Reda can be downstairs, why he has to be up. Mm, was the, yeah, definitely it was the best DLC in Valhalla. I like 68. Yeah, hello Iris, how are you? Welcome to live stream. The Ghost Wolf. It is here for one week, so definitely better than on the dailies. So you can decide in the end of the week if something better is showing up at the dailies. I highly doubt that, but still it is a small possibility for that one. So we are having four garbage items, the best item that it is not gonna show. And if it's gonna be fixed, I would say the Friday will be actually today to that to happen so if this is empty on the weekend yeah we are missing the one weekly once again but ghost wolf 150 opals and mystical pants 100 opals so long so let's take a quick look of the wolf and of course, we need to change into the night time, because on the day time, not that visible. So let's meditate. And how are you doing, Iris? 
We are almost ending the stream, so just the perfect time to see. Oh no 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 no! Yeah, pretty pretty cool looking, transparent, little bit glowing. I wonder if you can take really good picture. Ooh, this is looking actually pretty nice. So if nothing else, definitely for the photos. Let's see. That is too blue. Not gonna go here. So I think about 36, 35 ish. Alright, that is actually not that bad. Oh, I have the sixth item. It is... So, it is like double mystical pants. Oh no, and now he's dead. No... Uh, I don't have the six weekly socks. I love Odyssey Arena. Yeah, definitely that arena and the Conqueror paddles in Odyssey. They are, they are just awesome. So let's get back into the shop once more, and after that, end of the stream. And already huge shout out to everybody. And. A special shout out in this live stream goes to Casper for becoming a member. So welcome mate once again. Uh, Ghost has new horseshoes apparently. By the sound it may <laughs> Yeah that, that, uh, that doesn't make any sense though. Horseshoes on the paws. I mean, that got a hurt. The canines, they are pretty sensitive from the paws. Good day, good day! So, just 8 item and complete helix shop, and I don't spend money. So, mystical pants, ghost wolf, missing item, hunter, left arm had 2. Saxon Cross, Mystical Back Tattoo, and Military Monument. So, Iris, if you are seeing all six items on the weekly selection, let me know what is this missing one because we should have six weeklies instead of five. So, if anybody is seeing the missing one, let us know in the comments or in the chat while you still can. But yeah, only buy for me was the Ghost Wolf mount. But I think it is time for to end the stream, so thank you. Also remember to hit the like, hit the sub, turn on the notifications so you won't ever miss anything that I upload when I go live or when I post something and I do daily posts about this these little guys, awful selections every day, all day. And yeah, also remember, have fun, stay safe, be strong, hope to see you in the next one. Skatha, over and out, and bye bye.